Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. And here we have Tottenham against Lazio. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Hi Peter, it's great to be here. Two starting lineups. Underway. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? I'm going to go for Antonio Candreda because he brings a dynamism to proceedings, fast and direct. Feeling... Goal! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Quite exquisite, brilliantly dispatched. Well, I thought it was very well worked on the right side, but don't underestimate the volley. They can be a difficult skill. Lazio didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Djordjevic. Kane. Tries a through ball. It's a throw in. And it's Kay. Dyer. Look forward. How does he try from here? Just a whisker away. a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. Kane plays it out to the wing. Tottenham are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Christian Eriksen passes it through. Chadley. Bonazzi. And scored inside the first ten minutes to make it 1-0. Looks to slip it through. Now the pass. It's Kane! No mistake! And already they're looking to run away with it. And that is stunning. Just too hot to handle. Well, the technique generates the power in that situation. And once power is assured, any goalkeeper's up against it. Tottenham 
Tottenham get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Benazzi. Contreva. Eriksson. Dyer. Lamella. Has a look inside the box. Lamella's cross, Kane! Good delivery, no joy. Yeah, and it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position, but quite a static defence, was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode. It should have been much worse. And away. Lamella with the ball through. Carolo. Needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Carolo. Georgievich. Lulic. That is going to be the final action of the first half. Tottenham ahead 2-0, and they are looking good. That gets things going for the second half. It's Djordjevic. Dembele. Eriksson. Out to the left it goes. Benazi. Where to from here? Looks like a good ball through. Got offside that time. Comfortable. And well played, he saw that coming. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And it's Kandreva. Keita. Kane. Now it's Chadley. Hit into the middle. And that's been repelled. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Oh, he's not going to get that. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. Oh, it's a poor throw that. Picked off with relative ease. Done very well to intervene. To safety. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Kandreva brings it forward. Big chance! Oh, it looked like 3 0 for sure. Oh, that could so easily have been game over. There would have been no way back from three behind. Tottenham have time on their side now, as well as a two-goal lead. It is just about done. He's picked him out. Mauricio. Basta. Now the pass. It's a brilliant interception. Trevor. Another piece of really good defending. 
And that's that. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Well, I think when you score with your first effort and goal, there's a good chance that things are uh, going to go your way for the rest of the game. And to be fair, they used the impetus it gave them to gain a level of control, and I think they went on and deserved to win. Many thanks.